Hey, welcome back, gamers. This is Banished Soul. Plant Skull and Bones here, your host, Captain Cryptic. I am looking to see what kind of new content we have. So we have some guys jumped over and they farm Lepest real quick, and he managed to get three Zama Zam threes out of a chest. So that's pretty cool. It sounds like you're going to be getting those weapons coming out of those lock boxes. So always something great to look forward to as you are farming out the content. There's nothing new on the bounty board or the job boards or any black market. There's no new updates for ship upgrades, furniture upgrades, or weapons upgrades, or anything fancy at the refinery. Checked all that stuff out. Wanted to see exactly what, what we were looking at. But when we logged in, we got this post up. And it told us to check your mailbox. So we came to the mailbox. There was nothing over there. So I thought maybe we were looking at is there some kind of a note and there's no notes either so not exactly sure what's what's up with that we're going to check our map here and see if there is any new content as far as world missions I believe that's going to be a legendary high ship not seeing any new world missions yet that doesn't mean there's not any it just means that there's nothing loaded up on the screen at the moment so not a real big deal but yeah so that's looking like if you've been trying to grind out those wyvern's breath and the gannet salt peter and stuff like that sounds like you're gonna have the option to drop those and not even have to worry about building them or buying the blueprints or anything like that so that could work out for you but i definitely recommend that you do get the blueprints because those drops aren't going to last forever and eventually we may be able to actually upgrade these weapons, which is kind of what it was sounding like. Whispers of the Deep. That is a whisper. That means you could actually pick that up and not have to use the contract to do the sea monster. So we could do that if we come back to the nature and then pick up and then come up here and do another sea monster. So that's how those whispers work I'm sure y'all probably know that this has been in there since the beginning content of the game so but that's what we're looking at folks so there's going to be some stuff out there to grind to help those who have been at the lower end uh, not really grinding out for that stuff or maybe you're new to the grind so sounds like you're not gonna to have to grind as hard as a lot of us who started on day one so that should bring your ships up to spec which is going to make pvp a little more a little more challenging which is good because sometimes you come across some ships i don't know if you've noticed them they're just really spongy man so hopefully hopefully they're going to get some some good weapons and some good armor out of out of this new uh update here for everyone but uh like i said when we reported in one of the things we've seen with the questions that they were having is that it sounded like we were getting some new some new stuff headed our way i know we were all crossing our fingers for this update but we'll have to wait till next week to see what they've got in store for us from what it's seeming like but definitely if you've noticed something new let us know so we checked this guy earlier they still have pest control i'm sure one of the things that they did was update your smuggler pass so we should be looking at challenges, which would be for week six. Yep, so week six challenges got refreshed for everybody. We'll check our cosmetics over here. The apparel. Maybe this defiant thing they were talking about is something in here. Let us find out. It may be something we already opened up, so didn't really need it, so... That's always a possibility because, like I said, we, we grind pretty hard on, on this team. So it's rare if it's an item that was available before for us to not already have it. Wow, she's as long-winded as Rima. Okay, I'm seeing a gold dot. Nothing there. Should be something new in here because it gave us that gold dot. Oh, I'm betting it's that. Let's see. So that's going to be at the store to buy the, the mask.
Hmm. We'll continue to check just to make sure. Hey, there we go. Primordial beast teeth. Pretty sure I had that already. Just haven't gotten in there to look. Here we go. Looks like a lot of tats. I think these are just stuff that's opened up over the weeks. I'm not big on the tat cosmetics. Put them on the character. I mean, they look cool on some. So nothing there, folks. Let us go check our ships real quick just to make sure. And we will come down here to manage. Let's check our cosmetics out. Definitely want to check out the fireworks because that was something that looked like it was showing some fireworks there. Not really seeing any new fireworks. Well, doggone. Alright, guys. So, looks like we are just going to have to continue on for the next week, everyone. And uh, keep grinding. It looks like we're going to be getting paid off a little better for our grind. So, maybe you'll be able to get those sales that you've been looking for with them Mangoden sales. Or maybe even the Lopez sales. So, that's going to be a really good treat for everybody that's that's uh, been hunting for that stuff and not been able to find it. It sounds like it was dropping pretty heavy. A lot of guys are calling out the cosmetics they're getting, and even a lot of the weapons that they're getting as well. So, if you're new to the game, definitely make sure you tie up with a group. If you're looking for a group, message in the comments. We'll get you an invite over there. So, you could you group up with us. We'll help you farm out that stuff if that's what you're needing. And, and hey, man, maybe you want to stick around and, and just join the team. That's always welcome as well. So, y'all have a wonderful evening, guys. We're going to end the stream, hook up with everybody, and get us a farming on.